Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to Netflix to Xanthus Gaming. We're in Challenge Rift 104 on the EU side of things, and we are running a pet build, which is kind of janky. Um, I'm going to go ahead and move my Spirit Walk onto my left click. No, I'm not. I'm actually going to move my Acid Cloud onto my left click. I'm going to move my Spirit Walk into my 2 slot or my W slot. And I'm just get rid of the darts. We don't need them at all. All right, I think we're good to go. So our pets are gonna do almost all the damage for us, but we can left click for putting a pool of like acid on the ground. That's cold damage. And then we can right click to possess enemies with haunt. It doesn't do a whole lot to them, but I guess it's something we can do while we wait for our pets to kill everything. Uh, the setup here is not running a, a uh, low man's finger. I think that's the one that makes your bruisers or your uh, gargs turn into three. It's either tall man's or little man's, I can't remember. Um, but we don't have that. We do thankfully have a Tasker and Theo, which is helpful to us. We have a Soul Masher that I guess when you kill an enemy, you explode for some life per kill. Um, meh. We have Obsidian Ring of Zodiac, which lowers our cooldowns when we use our Spirit Spenders, which is how we get our jaunt back. So that's another reason to be casting our uh, Acid Cloud and our Haunt, because those are both Spirit Spenders. But yeah, let's go ahead and just get into it. It's a pretty straightforward rift. It's not too bad. All right. Nope. Summon your pets. Super important. They do everything. <laughs> Your pets are your bread and butter in this particular build. I'm just gonna spirit walk through these guys. I'm done with them. You can kind of force your pets to leash up to you if you spirit walk way ahead, and then the pets will kind of reappear at your location. So that's a little trick that you can do, I guess. I'm gonna go down this way, I think, and then up here, I think is the way I wanna go. pet went the wrong way. <laughs> All right, I think I missed a elite right here. Yeah, okay. He was down below there. He kind of came up to me, thankfully. Um, on the map, it's marked at the correct spot. I just kind of skipped over him by accident there. Our spirit walk allows us to get quite a bit of movement in, redirecting our pets and everything else up to us. We can recast our garg on our location if he gets stuck on trash that we don't care about like he did there, um, and that'll be helpful for you. And then we're just gonna walk through and kill things. Next floor, we just got a huge pack of trash right here in the center. So I recast my Garg on that area with the idea of having him help us out here, right? And we're gonna Spirit Walk into the middle of this, bring our Garg up to us. I'm gonna actually Bypass these guys, grab the conduit, let the conduit do most of the work here. Our Garg should be on this guy, but you can see how slow, even with a conduit, he was dying if my Garg is not hitting him. My Garg is the main source of my damage, for sure. The Spirit Bra, or the Acid Cloud, is just so I can feel good about myself. Lol. Alright. And just keep moving forward with our conduit, letting it help us kill these things a little bit. And we have an elite coming up here. We could have had the conduit for him if we would like force walk straight to him and skipped all that trash. Uh, that's probably actually a bit quicker, to be honest. But we didn't do that, so oh well. No big. We'll still beat it in plenty of time. It's not going to be like a top five score or anything, but it'll work out. Not a big deal. Garg recast up here for us. That's nice. There is an elite over here that we didn't quite get. There he is. And just move through. Arcane cutters don't mean nothing to us. And then here we just kill the trash as we walk through. Thankfully with the power pylon, our acid cloud actually does a little bit of damage now. Uh, so we can kill some of the trash with it. Uh, looks like there is an elite up here. That's pretty sweet. I actually didn't even get this far when I was clearing the map for, or when I was getting the map. Um, just because I spawned the Rift Guardian a little too soon, but there it is. And that should spawn the Rift Guardian. Sweet. I'm just going to cast my Haunt on him and then spam my Acid Cloud a few times. And then just let my pets do the rest of the work. 
it and that is the challenge shift. Hopefully that helps you guys out if you're having any trouble with it. Oh, it is a top five time, lol. That's just because uh, the challenge shift just went up. Give it a couple hours and that'll be like clear 200. But hopefully this helps you guys out. If it did, make sure you leave a like, favorite, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye YouTube.